Shepherd and King from the first Samuel and second Samuel books in the Old Testament and from Psalms the Lord is my shepherd I shall not want this is about David David was the great grandson of Ruth and Boaz David took care of sheep he provided food and water from for them kept them safe from other other animals found them if they got lost, and brought them back home. One day, an important man of God named Samuel visited David's family to choose the next king of Israel. God chose David, the youngest son, to be the next king. The Bible says, And the Spirit of the Lord rushed upon David from that day forward. God was with David, protecting him and giving him what he needed, just like a shepherd. Later, the Israelites were fighting against people called the Philistines. One Philistine was a giant named Goliath. He kept saying that he was stronger than God's people, and he wanted to fight. All the Israelites were afraid. But David was not afraid. He knew that God was his shepherd. He knew God would help him win so that all the earth may know that there is a God in Israel. When Goliath saw David, he laughed. David was so young and small, but David said, You come to me with a sword and with a spear and with a javelin, But I come to you in the name of the Lord of hosts, the God of the armies of Israel, whom you have defied. David knew it did not matter how strong he was, because God would help and protect him. And God did. Goliath was defeated. David became king of Israel. He tried to love God and help his people do the same. But he made many mistakes, just like everyone else. But God made a promise to David. God promised, Your house and your kingdom shall be made sure forever before me. Your throne shall be established forever. One day, another shepherd and king would come from David's family. This king would rule forever, and this shepherd would protect us forever. The question is, who protects you and gives you what you need?